Hello everybody, um, so I was going to do a cooking video where I cooked, but I didn't have enough room on my phone for that, so I couldn't upload it, and so a couple days, actually today, um, so today Ron t asked me, I made, if you guys don't know, I might have talked about it before, but um, I made a drink in Rec Room. You you probably know what that game is. Um, if you've watched my channel, um, first stream. Um, my channel's first stream is a Rec Room stream. Um, anyways, um, so I don't know. <laughs> um, so technically. I made a soda pop, whatever you guys call it, wherever the meow you live. Um, so, it's called Canide. I might have talked about it before. Um, I was, I made it um, on the video, but like I said, I couldn't upload the video because I didn't have enough space on my phone. And so I'm going to show you guys how to make Canide. Lemon lime flavored. There's a bunch of different flavors. Um, so... First thing I need is lemons and limes. Lemon and limes. You got one lemon and two limes, but really you just need one lemon and one lime. So, lemon, two limes, I only need one lime. So, you're also going to want a cutting board to cut the lemons and limes with. Um, you'll also want a knife. Is this the one I No. This one. That's definitely not the one, because that looks like a freaking katana. This one also looks like a katana. <laughs> That's definitely not the one. <laughs> Which one did I use yesterday? Oh, I think this one would work. Yeah. And so you also need, like, come on, right over here, a juicer. You don't need a juicer, you can juice the um, lemons and limes however you, you feel is right some people may do it with their hands some people may do it with the juicer like i do some people may do it with a masher i don't know who knows so i'm gonna start with the limes there are still two other ingredients um that i don't have out yet um i'll get those when they're needed um and of course be very careful with the knife and also take off the tag. You don't have to take off the tag. I'm just taking off the tag. I don't know. No. So yeah, be careful with the knife. Because knife is dangerous. Life lesson, kids, if you're watching. Knife is dangerous. Lime. I've actually never had lime before. <laughs> I've had, no, I didn't taste it. And I wouldn't because I have my retainer in. And I don't want to get it like, stained. Because I'm not supposed to eat or drink anything other than water without my retainer. So, uh, okay. That's out of your guys's. Oh, there. There we go. <laughs> Stay there. <clears throat> so yeah, this takes a little while. Um, It's not too difficult to do, though. And yeah, like I said, you don't have to use um, a juicer. I, you can use whatever feels best. 
whatever works best for you. You can use a masher, your hands even, if you are able to, as long as you cut it in half. If you don't cut it in half, I'm not sure how well that would work. And I'm sure you could probably find some other ways too that I haven't named. So if you guys have anyone in your family who likes, or anyone you know who likes pop or soda or, or whatever you call it, or maybe at least likes cooking or something, send this to them and they can maybe try and make it. It's pretty simple. I'm also going to make a strawberry one later on because I can do that, but I'm going to need some help with that one. Last time I made this, um, which was on the video I was making yesterday, I actually got some pulp in it and it was so good, oh my god. I like pulp. Ugh, I got some on my lip. <laughs> actually, it doesn't taste nice though. Honestly, it kind of smells good. I've never smelled wine before. Does that look hollow enough? I think it is. This little cat thinks it is. And no, this is not to be confused with Sprite or like Ceramist or anything. Speaking of Sprite, I've got some Sprite right back there. No, 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 right, right back there. In the, in the, in the, in the, the, no, not the free, the fridge. There's two, there's still, well actually no, not two more, like three, maybe four more. No, three. Yeah, there's still three more ingredients that I haven't gotten yet. But those come after I juice everything, so. I honestly don't really know which one's better, strawberry or um, lemon lime. I just got a really good flavor idea. I'll tell you guys the flavor idea I have. I just got after I'm done with this lime. Okay, I'll just tell you now. So, I just had a really good idea for a flavor. Strawberry banana. Tell me in the comments how that sounds. If YouTube lets me have comments on this video. Um, either way. Yeah, tell me in the comments how you think strawberry banana would sound. Okay, there's all the lime. It's lime right in here. Time for lemon. I'm gonna cut his hair off. <laughs> mm. yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Fine. Well, whatever. I'll do it the normal way, I guess. Cut. 
I had absolutely no reason to do that. Seds. There are seds. I mean, of course there's seeds. Oh. It's a lemon. Of course there's seeds. And so yeah, like I said, you don't have to use a um you don't have to use a juicer. You can use whatever feels best for you. And if you don't have like a juicer or something, same thing. Do exactly do however it feels best. I don't I don't know. Do my words make sense anymore? I don't know. Seed kind of came over to you guys. Look at this. Look at this little boy. He was like right over here. He was like inches away from my phone. Look at him. Look at this guy. Boing. Ooh, I just had an idea. We could grow a lemon tree. And then you get free lemons. What about lime seeds though? Where do you come from? It'd be pretty cool to grow my own, like, lemons and limes. That'd be great. Free lemons and free limes. With just one lemon seed, you can make an entire lemon tree and get pretty much an entire um, infinite stock of lemons. Only problem is that growing a lemon tree takes... A kind of long time. Oh my god. I forgot that this fills up a lot faster when it, you squeeze the lemons. Because lemons, if you look at the size comparison, hmm, I wonder which one looks bigger. Which one looks bigger to you? Um. Oh. Eat. So that lemon's out. The lemon with the odd hair is up. You know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna. No, you get to keep your hair. I'm just, okay. Box, or, no, not box, square. Well, square boxing kind of thing. No, it's not square no more. It's okay, kind of square. So, now that we've got everything juiced out, that's a lot. So, I'll get the next ingredients that we need. So, now we will not need a cutting board anymore. After you have your lemons and limes squeezed out and only one lemon and one lime is all I used. You can use as much as you want, but I only used one lemon and one lime. Um, so now at this point, once you're done juicing both the lemons and limes, or all the lemons and limes, um, you will 
you will not need this cutting board anymore. Um, you can keep it out if you want. I'm just gonna kinda throw it to the side over here. Um, you won't need the knife either. Um, but what, what you will need is a spoon. It doesn't matter which size as long as it's, you know. Um, and then you will also need I know, where is the bubbly water we just got? What? What? Top shelf, I think. Is this it? What? No, that was not it. Yeah, where, where is it? mistaked sparkling water for normal water. Wow. Okay. So you need sparkling water, the spoon. I am not tall enough, surprisingly, I am not tall enough to reach the sugar because it's way up there. Yeah. So I need to stand on a stool. Small. Sugar. Cut the sugar. Sugar. So, yep. Got us the sugar. Sugar. Uh, any size cup. I'll just take this one. Hold on. Take my retainer out. Um, now, uh, let's see. So you're going to want to take this little lid thing, you will blobber off or whatever. Um, also, make sure, guys, if you're using like a, um, if you're using like your hands, um, make sure you squeeze it directly into a cup or something like this. Um, so you can either already have it in the cup or you can pour it using this. So, yeah. And so, now what you're going to want to do, make sure you don't pour too much in, but get some of your sparkling water. Eek. Eek. Nope, 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 nope. Stay. 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 No. Absolutely. Well, nope. No. Bad. Bad. Okay, good. Good. You stay down there. I can feel you. Okay. So don't pour too much in. I'm gonna pour it slowly. Get it to go up. Um. So there we go. So just like maybe just a little under 400 is at is where the um, stuff is is where the lemon lime is. So make sure you don't pour too much sparkling water. Um, make sure it doesn't overflow. Um, so yeah. And so then you're going to want to take your sugar, sugar, sugar. I don't know. You're going to want to open your sugar. Obviously, you want to open the sugar. So, you're going to take a spoonful of the sugar. You're going to dump the sugar into the canine. So, then, after each dump, you're going to taste test it. And so, each time you taste test it, you make sure um, that it tastes okay. And so if you don't like the taste, you add more sugar. 
So, yeah. Sometimes it may be bitter, sometimes it may be sour. And sometimes it may be just right. So, yep. Get me some sugar. Dump. And so after, and like I said, each time you put sugar in, take a taste test. I see, actually. Definitely needs to be stirred. Stir it. I entirely, I entirely forgot that you have to stir it. So technically you need two spoons. Or you can use a, a fork to stir it. You just need um, a spoon to scoop and put the sugar in. Step, step, we'll take a look. Let's see how it tastes now. You get over there, bubbles. I don't need the bubbles in my way right now. Okay. Not bad, not bad. And definitely use some more sugar. Okay. Got the sugar in. Now mix it. I can hear that. Move, 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 move. I'm gonna take a couple. So, I'll tell you um, a little bit about what it is. So, originally, I intended for it to be a sugar-free drink, but I mean, it's a, it's like a pop. So, not sure how that would have worked. Um, but anyways, yeah, I intended for it to be a sugar-free drink. Um, but it just doesn't taste good without sugar. Um. And so, yeah, and you need the sparkling water to, like, make it fizz, like, pop, like a Sprite or something. Like, Sprite or Coke or Ceramist or something. If you wonder why, I'm keep, why I keep doing it, um, Sprite instead of, like, Coke or anything else, because Sprite is my favorite. <laughs> Not sponsored. Sadly, nobody will sponsor me ever. And it takes a lot of sugar, so just warning you. By drinking this, technically you're signing up to a drink of pretty much pure sugar. But it is fresh squeezed, as and you can see that, so fresh squeezed drinks are the best drinks, honestly. bubbles could move that would be very helpful but they will not perfect that is perfect so once you perfect it you're gonna want to take a cup uh, also Uh, just a little one? Okay. 
because I've got plenty. So yeah, now that you have that, you can throw all the stuff in your sink or whatever is going to wash it for you. For me, it's a sink right over there. Um, if you have a dishwasher, good for you. You can use that if you want. Um, anyways, we can close up the sugar now. I'll put all this stuff away um, right afterwards. So, now that you have your um, canide, that definitely went up. If you can, it definitely went up. It went, actually, no, no, it did not go up, actually. Hold on, let me. Oh, it did go up a little bit. It's like halfway above 400 now. I don't know. <laughs> Four hundred point five, I guess. I don't know. Mm, let's see. So yeah, after you've got it perfected, you just really all you want to do pour it into cups to drink it, or if you want to save it, pour it into a container. In my case, it's this thing. I got it at Hobby Lobby. Don't ask. It, eh. So, yeah, pour it into whatever you're going to um, drink it from. And if you're going to save it, save it. Put it in something to save it with. In. Oh my gosh, that uses up so much of it. I can't really fill it up that much because my mom wants some. And I don't want to waste all of it. And I also want to save some, so... Now the rest of this, there's not too much left. I'm gonna save. What the catnip are you watching? Yeah, I ran out. <laughs> That's okay. Now, you don't have to do this part. I'm just doing it because reasons. You don't have to put ice in it. I'm just putting ice in it for reasons. Because ice is good. I can't be the only one who likes eating ice. Am I? 